Hey Mel, Collie here with your little routine for today. Okay, so we're going to start just with some breathing and then we'll go straight into the shoulder bridge. To lie down on your mat, knees are bent in line with your hip bones, feet are flat and just let your hand rest on your lower abdominals between your navel and your pelvic bone and just breathe in to your hands and as you breathe out, let the breath just sink down, let the abdominals release relax your sit bones and then as you breathe in push the hands towards the ceiling and then as you breathe out let the abdominals sink down so breathing in as you expand and exhale as you release let the shoulders go and let your jaw relax let the face soften and just feel the shoulders fit and let them feel equal on the floor Relaxing your toes. Let your hands come to the floor. And just press your arms gently into the floor. Let your shoulders feel just as if they're pressing into the floor as well. Let the neck feel long so your chin is gently tucked in. And then start to let the back sit into the floor as you roll up through the spine and reach through the knees. Take a deep breath in and then roll back down. Deep breath in and exhale as you roll up, rolling the spine off the mat bone by bone. Almost like you're picking up the spine, getting into the top, letting your shoulders stay where they are and exhale, come back down bone by bone as if you're pressing each vertebrae into the mat. Don't worry if you can't get all of the lower back into the mat, because to do so you might actually start to over tighten your shoulders. Just allow yourself to work with how your spine feels today. So take a breath in when you get to the top and breathe out when you come back down. Relaxing your toes and your fingers. And do one more, take a breath in. Breathe out, roll up. Breathe in at the top and breathe out, roll down. And then picking up the feet, you're going to bring the feet together and the knees together. Take your breath in as you exhale, take the knees over to one side, opposite shoulder stays down. Slowly come back, other side. Inhale, coming back, exhale to the other side. Inhale and exhale. And do one more on each side. Keep the breath flowing, relaxing your jaw. Keeping the knees together as much as you can. And then slowly coming back to centre, bringing your right knee in, lifting the head, lifting the upper body if you can, and straightening the other leg. Now if you find this is too much, then let your head and shoulders come down to the floor, especially if your neck starts to ache. Otherwise, if you come up a little bit higher, try and come off your shoulder blades. You can breathe in and breathe out. Breathing in for two and breathing out for two. Breathing in and breathing out. So you're doing four times, breathing in and breathing out. And then going straight into the crisscross, same legs, breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out. And breathing in, and breathing out, and breathing in, and breathing out. Bringing the feet back down, and then come back into your shoulder bridge. So rolling back up, reaching through the hips, reaching through the knees, arms staying down, press the floor away, and start to pick up the feet. One more on each side. Squeezing the glutes, lift up the hips, and then roll yourself back down. And then roll yourself over onto your front. Bringing the hands around to your back, let your elbows drop. Linking the hands together, holding onto the wrist, linking the fingers. Lifting the head and the heart off the floor, dropping the chin in, shoulders back. 
and then let your right cheek rest on the floor, hands down, elbows drop, and the knees, three kicks. And then stretch open, legs along, hands towards your feet, lifting your heart, turn the face to the other side, three kicks, let your elbows relax, and lift. Four times on each side. So on the second, now that's your second repetition, and coming into your third, elbows relax. Keep breathing. Relax your shoulders down. Lifting up the heart, extending the back. Hands come to the floor, coming up into child's pose for a moment, stretching it out, taking the pelvis back to your heels, and then rolling yourself up, bring your feet around in front, readjust everything, feet and knees together, straighten out the legs, linking the hands as you lift up to the ceiling, taking your heart up to your hands, reaching forward, and then rolling, and we'll come forward a little bit more, rolling yourself back. Allow your shoulders to go. Just until you feel as if your feet are going to lift. And then start to roll yourself back up. Lifting the head. Up towards your hands, lifting the heart. And then reaching forward. And rolling back. Let your shoulders go. Let your rib cage open. Let your um, collarbone relax. And then slowly rolling forward. And lifting, breathing in. And exhale. Take a breath in, and exhale, rolling back. Relaxing the jaw, try not to lift the head back too far. Let the shoulders go, and then slowly rolling back up. And lift. Slowly reaching forward, and coming back. So tossing, tossing here with your pelvis, rolling back away from your thighs. go round by your side, squeeze your glutes, bring the legs together, lifting up the hips, looking down towards your toes, pushing the floor away with your hands, come back down with your sit bones to the floor and then lifting and releasing and lift and release and lift and hold it nice and steady. Nice strong line from the ankles to the hips to your shoulders. And then slowly coming back down. And bring your feet together. Hold on to the ankles. And then start to lift the chest. And slowly coming forward into a stretch. Bringing the knees together. Bringing the feet out in front. Bringing your right knee in. Take it across. And hug it in with the opposite arm. Lift and, lift and twist over. Looking over your right shoulder. Slowly come back, change sides, and twist, and come back to centre, and release, bring your feet back together, close your eyes for a moment, take a deep breath in, and deep breath out, deep breath in, pressing the belly away, to make more room for all that oxygen to come into your body, and exhale. And deep breath in. And breathe out. And deep breath in. And release. And just being aware that throughout the day, for about a minute, ten times a day, focus on your slow, deep breathing. Just notice the rise and fall of the chest rather than the rise and fall of the belly be first, and then the rise and fall of the chest. So let your breath be initiated from the lower part, the abdominals, rather than from up here. And enjoy your day.